Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing my What I Got My Kid For Christmas video. So this year, if you guys are new to my channel, my son is going to be 17 months old. So I have a one and a half year old for Christmas this year, which is so crazy because I feel like I was just filming this last year and I was getting him like the tiny little like chewy toys and stuff like that. And now this year we have some bigger stuff for him. So I'm super excited to show you guys what I got and I have been loving watching everybody else's what I got my kid for Christmas videos. You guys have been helping me out so much um, with the stocking stuffer ideas and stuff like that. So I'm super excited to finally be filming my own and hopefully I can help someone give someone some ideas for Christmas presents. So again, I have a one and a half year old son. So these are kind of toys like geared around that age. To be honest, we did not get him a ton of stuff. I feel like we got him one, two, three, four, five, six, ish things and I know that might sound like a lot that might not sound like a lot I don't know it depends on the person it depends on the family but I also know that Jackson's going to be getting things from other people in the family he's gonna be getting things from grandparents and extended family and stuff like that so that's why I wasn't too worried about like the number of things and we also didn't want to go crazy with spending money on a one and a half year old so everything but one thing we actually got from tj maxx max and i went shopping on black friday and got all of this stuff and obviously like tj maxx doesn't really do like black friday deals but they do um because they already do have like really good prices on their stuff but this is just oh wait no we didn't even get this from tj maxx we got this from jc penny okay so scratch that we did not get everything from tj maxx i guess i'll just show you what i'm talking about so the first thing right here is this what is this even called rainforest dance and tunes step on keyboard so we went to jc penny on black friday like i said and we got into the store i think at like 8 45 and they close at 9 or something like that we only had 15 minutes to shop is pretty much what i'm trying to say and we just ran through the kid aisle and we're just like trying to find something that caught our eye and this right away caught my attention because jackson loves just like running around on the floor just dancing around he loves like moving his feet it sounds really weird but if you knew him you would understand what i'm saying he just loves to be moving so i saw this and thought that this would be so fun for him hopefully it's actually like as big as this picture is showing it to be because if it's smaller than this like i feel like it might be kind of too small but i thought this was just so cute and it says you can plug in any mp3 players so I'm excited to plug in um, like our phone or something and just play some of our own music on here. But I think this would be really cute. It says 19 step on keys, 10 built in songs, 8 animal sounds. Oh yeah, it says the approximate mat size is 48 inches by 26 inches. So 4 feet by 2 feet. So that's a pretty good size actually. So I don't know. I'm really excited about this though. I feel like he'll have a lot of fun with this. Especially because I was looking for Christmas for him to get him more interactive toys. Because I feel like right now he has a lot of toys that just kind of like sit and then he has to play with them i don't know if that makes sense but like he has like stuff like this like he has like a truck and then like there's stuff in the truck that he can play with like blocks and stuff like that but like blocks aren't very interactive if if you get what I'm saying. So I'm looking for toys that kind of like make noise, light up, like he can interact with more rather than him sitting on the floor playing with blocks. Cause I feel like he gets kind of bored with stuff like that. So I'm super excited that I found this cause I think he'll have so much fun with this. And this was only, this was $30 at JCPenney and they were having, I think it was like, either 40 or 50 percent off so i'm pretty sure we only got this for like 20 dollars. so the next thing is actually something that we found the night before on thanksgiving when we were over at my family's house they had this toy and jackson had so much fun with it like i have never seen him sit and just look at a toy and play with a toy for so long so i was like we need to get him that so we found what it was called online and we actually found this at tj maxx for 20 dollars. so i'm so excited because i actually found it on amazon which is how i found the name of it but I found it on Amazon and it was, I think, 30, 
30 to 40 dot 35 dollars on amazon so it was definitely more expensive and it was almost the same exact thing and it didn't come with the cars it was just the track so what this is is it says magic tracks and this is like the rescue version because these are the ones that they had at my aunt's house and he loved it it's um a police car and it has the the lights like the sirens actually like go off and they light up so and then it also comes with a fire truck and it's just these tracks that like move i don't really know how to explain it if like if you don't know what i'm talking about but it's 200 pieces of glow track and it just like it's just this like tr this car that just goes around the track and you can bend the track into like whatever shape you want and he had so much fun with it like he seriously had so much fun with it he was moving the track around he was playing with the cars you can take the cars off and they can you know roam in the kitchen or on the carpet or whatever but he had so much fun with this on thanksgiving so when we saw it the next night we had to get it and it was only 20 dollars. so we also got him this so the next thing we got is this rainforest band drum set why is everything like rainforest themed yeah that fisher price piano is rainforest dance and tunes what the heck why is everything rainforest well this to me is like a band in a box i saw something similar to this when i was at tj maxx we also got this from tj maxx this was a 12 dollars so i thought that was a really good deal 12 dollars for all these things inside of here i saw my reflection in the window and i got so scared for a second but for 12 dollars, i think this is a great deal especially for all you get in it it says the set includes drum drumsticks recorder castanets tambourine and maracas so i think he'll have so much fun with this because he loves anything that makes noise and is loud and obnoxious so i think this little like drum is really cute so this next thing i got i actually picked up today from target because i was going to put it in his stocking as a stocking stuffer but then when i saw it i was kind of like i don't know i feel like this could be a cool present i feel like it's a little too much to put in a stocking and i feel like why not just give it to him as a present he can unwrap it and i think it'll be cute so this next thing is a play-doh and this is their starter set so i wanted to get him something that was was not like a ton of pieces because I don't even know if he knows how to how to do play-doh yet but I didn't want to get him just the play-doh and have him like not have anything to use with it but I didn't want to get a bunch of pieces so I thought this was perfect they actually had this at Target for ten dollars but I found it online for six fifty so they were able to price check it for me so I got this for six fifty and I just think it's super cute and it's nice and compact and little especially because I don't know like I said if he'll even know how to do play-doh yet but it comes with like a little like um um, roller cutters some scissors some shape cutouts a little um what are those things called rolling pin a little knife and then it comes with four um little things of play-doh down here so i think he'll have a lot of fun with this if he knows how to use it if not then we can just store it and wait a little bit longer but i think he'll have a lot of fun with this especially like i said if he does know how to use play-doh like if he gets it and he understands it i think he'll have a lot of fun with all the little like tools and stuff it came with the next and final thing that i have to show you guys because there are there is another thing that i can't show you i don't have it yet um um, but this is the last thing that we have and I actually don't even know if I'm gonna give this to him for Christmas or I'm gonna give it to him before Christmas but um this is another thing I got at TJ Maxx it's just a little robe and I got it for $13 and I just thought this was so cute especially because if you saw our Christmas pictures it was this like super cute buffalo plaid print so I'm loving this and it is the softest material ever like it is so soft and cozy I wish I had this I feel like this is probably gonna be like as long as him if I don't know even know if you can like see the whole thing but this will probably look literally go from his neck down to the floor because this is size this is extra small and this is size four four five i don't really know what that means but it was in like the the toddler kid section so i don't know i think it'll fit him it'll just be like his whole body length but i thought this was so cute and i just think like robes and slippers are so cute i want to get him a pair of slippers but i haven't found one that i know would fit him yet so i don't know if i want to give this to him on christmas though like wrap it up and give it to him on christmas or maybe i'll um put it in his like christmas eve box because we're gonna try doing that as a tradition this year too i want to start that is get, doing the um like the christmas eve boxes i've seen a lot of people on youtube um and like facebook and twitter and stuff they do this little christmas eve box where you do something you wear to bed um like a movie or a book to read before bed read or watch before bed like a little packet of hot chocolate and then a thing of like popcorn or something just like a snack a drink a movie a book and then something to wear to bed so i thought that this would maybe be really cute to put in the christmas eve box like to wear 
when he wakes up in the morning for Christmas, if that makes sense. So I don't know if I'm gonna do that for like his Christmas Eve box yet, or if I'm just gonna give it to him or do it on Christmas. I don't know, but I thought I would include it because I technically did buy it for him for Christmas. I just don't know when I'm gonna give it to him yet. And then lastly, the final thing that we got for him is a table and chairs. And actually we did not buy it from a store or anything. If you guys know me, I DIY'd all of the furniture in this house. The coffee table, the entryway table, the kitchen table, our nightstands, I DIY'd all of our furniture. So I thought I would do the same for his little table and chairs. And I'm not gonna go like extra and do like the wood finishes that I have on all of the furniture. Now, if you know what I'm talking about, if you watch any of my other videos you would have seen the furniture I'm talking about and I'm not gonna go super extra on his little thing just because it is for kids and I know he's probably gonna draw on it and whatnot throughout the years but I found a table and chairs on Facebook and I will insert a picture right here so you know what I'm talking about and I know it looks super run down and super old and everything but we went and picked it up i think it was like ten dollars i'm pretty positive it was only ten dollars and it obviously has some paint on it it needs to just be sanded down and repainted and it'll look brand new so i think it'll be perfect we're gonna tighten all of the um the hardware on it we're gonna fix one of the legs on it just get a new piece of wood fix a leg we're gonna sand it we're gonna paint it i think it'll look brand new and the table and chairs that i actually wanted to get him it was like 150 dollars and I just bought one on Facebook for 10 and we're just gonna refinish it and I think it'll look so cute. I'm really excited about it because I love refinishing stuff. I especially think it's so cool that we're gonna be, like Max and I are going to be like almost making or remaking a piece of furniture for him that he can have and have for years to come so I think it'll be really fun and really cute and I'm really sappy and sentimental like that so I'm really excited about it so I guess that is the final thing I got him for Christmas I also remembered after filming this that I forgot one thing down in the garage so this is the last thing we got him I just got this cute okie dokie blanket from JC Penny you I'm obsessed with buying blankets for Jackson and it's the whole like moon and stars thing it says it's $24 but I got it on sale for eight and it literally is like this like soft Sherpa material so yeah I just wanted to show that I also got this for him so i know it may not have seemed like a lot but again like i said he is going to be getting other things from other family members and whatnot so i know he's going to get a ton of stuff for christmas and max and i i don't know why i say max and i because max paid for it but we also just got a new um ipad mini not necessarily for jackson but like we bought it for the intent of we're gonna put like a, a big chunky kids case on it so that when we go out places and he wants to watch Chuggington or something, then we have that for him because when we go out places now, we give him our phones and then he just destroys our phones and that's something that I'm not buying a new one of. So we are going to use the iPad. <laughs> so yeah, we didn't um, buy a brand new one. We bought one used off of Facebook, but it's still really nice. So um, that's also another reason we didn't necessarily go crazy budget wise on Christmas presents for him because we did just buy something like an iPad. But that is it for everything I got my kid for Christmas. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be having a stocking stuffers video coming soon. I have all this stuff sitting right there. I'm going to film that video next. So that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below, leave us any comments or questions you may have because we love hearing from you. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. I'm sitting on my feet and they're so asleep and it's like so painful right now. There's like needles going into my feet and my legs.